Have you ever been criticized with the way you use your words? I've been very criticized. See, you see the bruise on my face. This is this police. Boys, the para, the eye, the red. They the merchandise, they the agitate, they the movado, they want retaliate. I think I'm one of those people who criticize, call the cultist, call different names. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We, 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 we're heading somewhere. Well, this is Grace TV. <laughs> It's King K to the A to the T to the T to the A. Voice of Grace TV. I've got the lyrical HR. How you doing, man? I will give glory to God. I'm fine. I'm doing well. God has been gracious and kind to each and every one of us. So I'm fine. It's good to see you. It's good to see it. <laughs> My honor to see you. Quite honestly, it's a blessing seeing you for the first time. And the vibe, man. I know this vibe no be fake. The original copy, the no photocopy. I, I dive into a lot of interviews that you've granted. Uh, I've seen uh, kind of things that you've done, your, your stage craft, coming to the stage with um, Anchor. You know, you know what it is? It means that you are deep. You, you want to pass a message for real. You get, you get. So before meeting you in person now, eh, your craft has spoken about you. You know, yeah. yeah. I, I, want to tell, I, I, I want you to tell your, your, your upbringing. How was it? My upbringing was, was nice. I was born in a very awesome, blessed home, a Christian home, blessed environment, born in Kaduna, Zaria. I grew up here in Abuja, but what took me to the south was academic school, university. So, for that, my, my, my upbringing was awesome. I know go see this one and this one and this one. I would try to paint pictures in terms of to entice people, like an artist. I be the one on pen, but not be the one with the draw. The one on pen with the words too. So now I be. True, true, true. You know when you when when you pick words, huh? You see, you are the one with the pen. Uh, I mean, not the one who draws. When you just try to, I mean, try to be lyrical, even with life itself, eh? You know, it means that you you are a man of your words for real. I want you to please just tell. Tell, tell the audience, with all this um, critique everywhere, uh, even online, you know, those Twitter savage, those guys I am playing, you know, I want you to tell me, mm, tell us, how has grace spoken for you thus far? That is what Jesus did for me on the cross of Calvary. That is why he left something in me that keeps me going more or less like a beautiful memory. Definitely, you have to be criticized when you do great things. You understand? You can't do big things when you are overwhelmed by by small things. Brother, preach. You understand? So criticism will definitely come when you know you are at the right track. People must definitely criticize. What is mouth there for? Not be too early chop. You must talk. So if mouth they talk, you know they chop. Okay, let's talk about lyrical H.I. Henry in fine Choco, right? Yeah, then you know why I'm emphasizing about your name, um, eh? HI. You know, a lot of friends who don't know you will just call you HI. You know, your your presentation, your outward look. I have a lot of um talks online to that guy who dressed like a courtist. Have you been, I mean, family, friends ever warned you for come on, can you just stay off that costume? You know, how, how have you been, uh, that man who staying so strong about how you? Present, you know how the, the household look actually matters as a craft. Huh? This is how you want it. Huh? Have you been so steadfast? Okay, no, this is my way. This is where I'm heading to. Tell us about it. The kingdom of God suffer a violence, and the violence for those who for those who want to take it, you should take it by force. You can't be like a lawyer and dress like an engineer. You understand? For you to be able to communicate the message first, your appearance is one of the things that sticks to the mind of people. It is called artistic. For me to remember what you say, I'll first of all remember how you look. And everybody has been designated to reach out to specific people. God has given me a voice to reach out to specific people. Paul said something that will reach some. You, are, you understand, in 1 Corinthians chapter 9, from 20, 21 to 22, he said, because of those under the law, I became like those under the law, though me not under the law, so I can do it, so I can win them. If you are called as a barrister to reach out to those in the judiciary, you will not dress like an engineer in there. You dress like one of them. 
you become like one of them. So you'll be granted the opportunity to win them. So me, God giving me that revelation and say, okay, this is what you have to do to win these people. You can't dress, there are some people that you can't reach. Except before you want to talk about a man and impact him solemnly in the area that you have been directed and purposeful, impacted by the Spirit to do so, you have to look like him. These beers, I don't love keeping beers, but most of these things are intentional. What I do is deep, like you said, from the onset. I don't just want to do things because I want to do them for self-aggrandizement or for selfish interest. First of all, the journey of life ends one day. We are pilgrimage in the face of the earth. When we end our journey, when we get to meet our maker, what, what do we go tell and say we do? You understand? In to say, if you know say now your hand will stop you from entering the kingdom, come out. If you know say now low, you understand the, most of those things. So I want my life to be to be modeled in a way that it is projecting Christ. I don't want to do my own stuff. If I want to do my own stuff, there's an endorsement deal that came for me this year. It's in the millions. In the millions. But it's subjected towards the secular aspect. People will say secular in what way? What I am projecting from my craft doesn't doesn't suit that. You understand? It doesn't suit it. Now, TV be no suitor. So based on one or two. <laughs> Here is where the next question comes in. Then see, I mean, before I tell you, you know, uh, Grace TV, but this section is not the usual one. This is uh, the street vibe. Yeah, I'm an hype man for real. I need to ask you now, has, the, has been your acceptance in the industry? Yes, tell us. I mean, been a journey in thus far. There's something about oxygen. I understand? There's something about oxygen. It is only the living that gets to benefit from it. <laughs> so you are deep. You are. You must. You must accept what I do. You deep. You deep. You you you, you tend to you tend to be very um, uh, uh, poetic, rap, rap um, figured when you are answering your questions too. Yeah. You see, I I. I saw somebody one time on stage who's trying to be what you're doing already. Hmm? I need to ask you, what would you tell such person? Definitely, people would love to emulate what is new, what is fresh, what is different. That's what people are doing with me. This is new, this is different, this is fresh. You understand? So definitely, if they want to accept, all these things are for the fortress of the gospel. They will use and reach out to other people too. You understand? Even the music we will get for the country now, we will be say everybody done. Maybe by mimicking other people. Nobody come out playing, Baba. The only person will come out playing, the person will pioneer the game. Nobody come out playing. So you understand? Everybody, they follow the thing that person will come out playing, they do. On the normal day, you be African. Now this can't close the way are. Hey! He's trying to get at me now. Okay, I, I need to ask you this question uh, because I'm the one asking the question here. HI, uh, you know, usually, uh, as an artist, usually we start with one, one genre of music, one kind, one style. Do we see you in the nearest future switching from being a poet, a rapper, into just singing because the industry, how it receives your kind of music? Okay. If you cut my flesh, what's it go come on our blood? If you match ants, what's it go come on be blood now water? You understand? The pressure where anything mount on me determine the real person where I be. I'll keep improving in what I do, not because we are doing it for the Benjamins, which is the cheddars, the team boys the come on. And they do them because of waiting I did called to do. So now I may have already give you previously for this interview, you see, Benjamins come my way. We are no we are no uncle. If I don't come, I'm here for day on You understand? Know, Pretty boys is called La Vida Loca. I mean, I do La Vida Loca. I do La Vida International. Understand? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is on you. See, hmm? distinguished ladies and gentlemen, I'm hanging now with the legendary in the making lyrical HI. That's been my question to you. I, I, the street vibe, how you been feeling? Definitely, now you don't already be indoctrinated into the system, even though mouse no day if you find your way around the keyboard. <laughs> you know, that's where I'm headed. I need you to just, um, your usual, I want you to just have the mic, I need you to just, you know, I mean, I, I mean, your question thus far huh, has been lyrical, so I need you to do just, I mean, like if, 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 if bar, like something for a, no, I don't want a bar, I, I want the old. 
right about now we are in tiki culture the word of god raised me and made me nurtured but i know i had a scar on my face maybe i guess i was punctured but i draw my revelation and words that came from the scriptures but deep inside of me is beyond nature but i have to become a man just to be on my nice posture sitting down looking fly i guess i had a nice composure but life is a race race marathon race race some people asking everything is getting a real space you say i'm deeper than depth how does that get me i'm reflecting the light you can sun let me i'm a man in my own cloud i'm the star descent god has blessed me with too many things you just said boy you're gazing at me but i guess when i'm going to heavenly place that's where i permanently stay no holidays in it but how do you understand god when you don't even get communion with him that's a relationship book what will bless god for the blessings we got that is why I pray every day for no man to ever take my place. And that is why God has to make that happen for me when he blessed me with grace. This is supernatural. I mean, I, I don't know we have crowd. I mean, they'll be going in whatever now, shouting, screaming, lyrical H I. I mean, you've done it all. I need to ask you this question. This is a bit personal. Are you married or, you know, the Igbo guy who does it's my sister? I'm not, I'm not married. Single. But I'm carried. <laughs> um, no, there's this your usual saying that grace carry me come. No be your kada. Kada man, yeah. It's a mystery. It's a mystery. Thanks for coming. We want to say thank you. It's Grace TV, and this is what we do. It's a swag everywhere. This is what we do, ladies and gentlemen. It's King K to the A to the T to the T to the A Voice of Grace TV and we here live with Lyrical HR. Hello, hello everybody. It is Lyrical HR. Who goes to sh- hey, Jesus, the anointing upon my life, not the pampa egg, the break the yoke. And keep it locked on Grace TV. Be that die. <laughs>